Hello everybody, another quick update on CS Online 2. New map, freebies, and of course, weapons. Sadly, I could only test 3 out of 4 since I couldn't afford the Scar H as for current. And if you notice, they are all the same firearms from CS Online, except that now we can own them permanently. Unfortunately, the Daewoo DR200 is specially reserved for PC Bunks, also known as Internet Cafes in South Korea. As we can see, a new ranking system has been established. So to achieve them, we have to complete the requirements, like killing a number of enemies for instance. Now we are in aquarium, and there's a lot of spots. The recoil's a little hard to control for the FFL, so I'll get killed if I were to spray. It feels heavy and bears a similarity to the SG-550, or maybe it's because of the firing sound. This map isn't really that huge, which makes it easier to engage in firefights in many areas and not confusing to navigate. Besides the crates and the rocks, there are not many obstacles that are cluttered everywhere, making it a simple yet fun map to play on. Next, we try the FN FNC. And I have to admit that Nexon does a fine job in animating their reloads for these weapons. Holding the body, exchanging the magazine, and pulling the bolt. That's some nice and fluid movements right there. Oh man, just got ambushed right there. And finally, the FN2000. One thing I noticed is that these weapons I'm reviewing are from the Fabric National. I wonder what new landmarks will be there in the future, but after testing them out, I'm so far impressed by their performances. So that's all for this review, thanks for watching and subscribe for more updates.